Uh oh. Hmm. Jewelry box, a big one. Oh, look at this, and it is full. Let me see. Put it right here. Almost there. Oh, wow. Hey guys, welcome back to the Scrap and Blind channel. We are about to open up our storage unit. We've got curbside junkies right here. Adam, Stacy's out there somewhere. They, they got another one down, down the way. And you guys got another one at another facility too, huh? Well, I got one for mom and dad. And then we got ours that have uh, has quite a bit of stuff in it. Should be pretty good. We're going to find out. So if you guys want to see that, go check out his channel. Most of you guys are probably subscribed, but if you're not, go do it. Let's get over here and look and see what's in here. So this is kind of what you see from the door. A lot of Christmas stuff, computer, some big furniture pieces. It's an interesting wooden box. Gun cleaning kit. Um, Kane, Adam's son, saw a cow or something in here that he wanted. But we'll have to get these boxes out kind of one by one and kind of go through them. So, should be fun. This is the first unit that we've bought in a while. Paid $40 for this, so I'm more than positive I'll make the money back. So, we'll see what happens. So just after moving the first tote, some stuff that's on the floor, a lot of Christmas ornaments. That looks like it's spilled out from a tote. But look at this. That's probably five pounds of possibly insulated copper, number one. And there's another roll there. That one's significantly, well, that's actually about the same weight. And then there's another one right here. So it's a good start. And this thing that I thought was a computer is actually a, a heater. And there's another one right here, another heater. Something that's covered up. Oh, that's kind of cool. I'll have to look at that better here in just a second. So one of the first ones that I opened up is just a shoe box. I was hoping the Jordans would have been in there, but it's a box of uh, half finished models. There's five of them, looks like. So that's kind of cool. And there's a bunch of boxes in here, big boxes. Let's go ahead and grab this tote right here, real quick. Bunch of toys. Elmo backpack. We're looking for a yeah, there's a Bucky's from it's a gas station around here. Big truck stop. Kane saw a cow with a football helmet. Oh, right here probably. This is what Kane wanted. This is what he saw in the unit and wanted, so there's that. We'll set him to the side. But the rest of this is just toys. Here's a basket full of random stuff. There's a little radio. Kind of need a bunch of books. This looks like it might have been a desk. What is that? Faith, hope, and love. Oh, just found some personal stuff here. Looks like a driver's license. We'll have to we'll return that. Actually, start a little this little jar full of stuff, and that was in a book. So we'll have to uh, go through all these pages. Okay, next box here appears to be some crafting stuff. Some bags and purses and doesn't look like anything's real good. There's some wires and stuff down there at the bottom. To 
to what though? Just a bunch of wires. Chick-fil-A. <laughs> I didn't know what. Hey, eh, look at all that wire. Is that take this. Some like Romex stuff. I think so. Here, there's that. And there's another roll this, down there. Cause I wanna help him. Well, there's not much room really. Hey, some mom and dad did pretty good. Really? Are they, they good? Got, uh, oh, you got a coach purse. Is it really? They're, so yeah, they're right down there by your. Oh, there's a coach purse. Oh wow! I pulled it out. And... Inside, they usually have a tag. Yeah. As it's old as that one looks, I believe shape. it's uh, I bet that one's authentic. Awesome. So that's like 30 or 40 bucks probably. Cool. Um, here's another box here. So this is definitely crafty type stuff. Um, oh yeah, this is like mostly craft material it looks like. Is that a picture frame? Yeah, that's a picture. So we will return all the personal pictures and stuff but yeah this thing's almost all crafty type stuff Lauren will know Lauren will know more about a lot of this cookbooks and things like that so what we'll do is I'm kind of quickly going through these boxes um, but we'll make another video dedicated to just like individually what was in all these boxes so you guys can get a get a chance to look at it for yourself and see if there might be anything that you guys actually wanted that you guys might want so that's kind of what we'll do all right another box looks like it has a lot of toys in it that's kind of neat mobile too bad cody's having a boy <laughs> But yeah, this looks like mostly just toys. So like I said, I'll go through it better. And if there's like really good stuff, I will I will show you guys later. But like I said, mostly toys in here. Except for that mobile, that'll actually probably sell pretty well. Starting to get kind of back here uh, towards the back. Noticing a computer. A bunch of totes. More boxes. I have no idea what that thing is. Looks like a headboard. There's a shop vac back there um and like i said a bunch of boxes that's what we like and ain't that the stuff that goes for like your uh that silver ain't that like uh for like your hvac systems your heater like the yeah 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 oh we had one of these too oh y'all had a computer well <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a good sign there's probably some inappropriates on there those magnets? Yeah. Oh, cool. Mine had to put the little, those just paper when I was a little girl. Another box. We can go through this one pretty fast. Those, oh, tablecloths. Some like powder. The floaty for the pool. Mm -hmm. And then let's see while we're at while we got the camera still on, we'll look at this one real quick. <laughs> and Lauren's gonna be real happy. Wait, what is this? Oh, okay, that's what I thought. More movies and CDs and DVDs. I've got so many at the house, and she's like what are you gonna do with all those movies but there's this one which that's actually a cool case yeah and there's one two more there's a selfie stick there's yeah there's so there's two more binders of movies plus this and then the rest of it looks like it's just paperwork so that's kind of that's cool well i like movies i'll kind of unbury myself here in just a second so this is a cool box and it's kind of heavy. Probably like for a wine or something. That's definitely all just paperwork. Well look, oh those are letters. We'll go, we'll look at a couple of them. Maybe they'll be full of cash. 
Cool Definitely a cool box. Let's see, what do we got here? Pretty sure we're definitely gonna make our money back. I actually needed one of these just yesterday for Lucas's swimming pool. Looks like a heater or a fan. It's probably a, yeah, it's a heater. And some miscellaneous extension cords. And then whatever this is. What does that say? Bun Bunchums? Bunchums? Oh, it's those little fuzzies. They're like plastic fuzzies and they can stick together. Oh, yeah? He's going to like that. Okay. Alright, I can already see a Barbie sticking out of this one. So, like more toys. But we'll go through. Oh, look. From Barney. This guy, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot of toys. We will go through all the stuff a little better. Oh, look at that, there's a camera in there. Lucas has been wanting me to get him. We actually found one. Um, we found one actually in the ground um, somewhere and it turned on and everything, but it just, it, it looked weird. The, the pictures were real bad quality, but oh yeah. We'll look at a couple of these boxes while we're while we're back here before we get them out i'm waiting on my dad to get back with the truck he went to go get some refreshments so see looks like a lot of personal stuff probably there's another bag a really nice bag I don't know what brand it is I can't tell it's not bad though what else might be in here some glassware I don't know the lighting is probably not very well yeah a lot of this is just glass there's a cool I believe that is that's just a statue I'm not sure of who So I want to give you guys a better look real quick at these shelves, uh, these cabinets rather. Um, personally, I think that all the money that we paid for the unit, I'm going to get back on just these shelves. These are real sturdy. Not sure if these are like particle board or not, but these are, like I said, they're super sturdy and they're in perfect condition. So they don't have any shelves on the inside, but I think we can get at least 10 bucks a piece for these shelves and there's four of them. And now I'm getting a better look at this headboard. Um, figure out something to do with that probably sell it or see if we can use it because we don't have a headboard for our bed so like I said I think we can make the money back just on the shelves alright so I got the truck loaded down with my dad's help um, we're going to go ahead and go through the rest of this probably tomorrow or in a couple of days um, I guess real quick we can go through one one more tote oh those are cool those are for boxing um there's the boxing glove that's cool there's the a a, a, a texas longhorns um laptop thing and there's a laptop <laughs> how did i not see a laptop sit, sitting right there 50 cents on the old chest. So some of this stuff was yard sale stuff. So my dad's ready to go. It's hot today, guys. Yeah, we should be able to get the rest of this stuff tomorrow. Oh, Lord. Oh, I found the cases for all the DVD. Oh. These movies are in there. Some of them. Well, that's a good score. So, yeah. So, here's that box. Uh, all the ones you saw had them in there? Every one of them. Every one on Fast and the Furious. There's a bunch of movies here. So, I may have a buyer lined up. Good. Yeah. <laughs> yep. 
So buy every one of them. here's the rest of it. I pulled this out, this uh, little case, just to see if there was anything in it. And it's just mostly like personal paperwork. So I'm going to leave the rest of it for now. And uh, we'll see you guys in a day or two. But for you guys, it's going to be about three seconds. <laughs> All right, so here we are back at the house. Lucas is going hey, through. Look, guys. <laughs> Lucas is going through this giant box of movies, seeing or box of movies, seeing if he can find anything for himself. So there is about a hundred DVDs here, probably. But there is a bunch of DVDs and there is a bunch of Blu-rays. And I've we uh, went through probably sixty percent of these. So far, I've only found one that was not in there. And it was uh, this movie called American History X, which is a really good movie. It was. What you got there? Fast and the Furious 6. Well, well, I haven't looked in there to see if it's in there yet. Yeah, it's in there. Mm, nope. One of the discs is, well, yeah, one of the discs is missing, but I saw it over there earlier. No, I saw it in this book. So, but we had a bunch of these books also. Had some like workout DVDs and stuff. There's a bunch of DVDs in there. We found a Space Chase race car game, guys. <laughs> um, so this right here is gonna I'll probably, I would say triple our money on this storage unit. We paid 40. I assume that we could get a dollar a piece on the DVDs and probably two to three dollars a piece on the Blu-rays. Hold on. And probably two to three dollars a piece on the, uh, the Blu-rays. Here, step over there real quick. And over there is a stack of Xbox 360 games. Probably not going to sell those. Probably going to give those to my dad because he's got an Xbox 360 that I got him, I think, last year for Father's Day, or maybe his birthday. But there's a couple of games in there he likes. He likes war games and sports games and stuff, and there is a few in there. So we'll let him pick through those. Um, and if this didn't get our money back and those cabinets didn't get our money back, check this out. I was going through some of the boxes of toys, which... We're gonna donate most of those toys, except for a couple that I got out for Lucas. But, check this out. This was sitting in the bottom of one of those boxes. It is a Nintendo 3DS, the uh, red version. It's in really, really good shape. It's real clean. Uh, the hinges are not worn at all. A lot of times you find these uh, Nintendo DS is with this little hinge and they're they're all messed up um, But I've got a charger for it. So if I will plug this up see if it works if it does you'll see it right here Super Mario 3D Land. And what? Hold on just showing them You're just showing Matt? No, I'm showing Everybody on YouTube. But if you did not see a clip right there, that means it didn't work. But if it does work, I mean, even the joystick is, this thing's like new. Um, I've been seeing these sell online on eBay anywhere from like 80 to $120. So I doubt we'll sell it on eBay. I just don't really sell much on eBay but it would be good for a game store. Um, even if we just traded in for credit and got me and Lucas a new game or something. So I'm really thinking that there's probably $100 worth of DVDs and D Blu-rays there, at least 75 here, $40 for the cabinets. I'm, I think we're doing really good on this. Um, of course, I haven't sold anything, so I can't give you an exact number, but that's where we're at right now. Here's one of the uh, other items that we found, the thing that was wrapped up. It's a, oh, it's a like a book, like an unfolded book, but I think it's The Last Supper. And it's like ceramic. That's really cool. I bet there's a few of you guys wouldn't mind having something like that. Um, we're getting ready right now to go and try and finish unloading, the, or finish with the storage unit. Got a couple things that we're gonna take to donate, mostly just toys. Um, all these are just some toys and there's stuff that maybe could have sold at a yard sale but i'm not i don't want to hold on to toys um there's a tote of christmas stuff that if you want to briefly look through it it's just mostly ornaments and stuff so um tennis racket uh some more toys so there's one two three 
three things of toy oh, this one that one and this one is all toys um this one there's a lot of books in here but there's also some toys um but it's it's good stuff stuff that people can get some use out of so but things that i didn't want to hold on to to try to sell at a yard sale we're gonna go see what else is in the storage unit empty out the truck and see if we can find some more good stuff let's see what we can find all right we are back here at the unit um going through some of the stuff just picked up this box here it's got actually some jewelry in it a little bit some stuff we'll have to look at closer to see if it's real could be though Thanks. what is that polo polo and bag a michael kors. and a michael course what are these called like coin purse Hand. that's nice Hand touch. well you know i don't know anything about that kind of thing but we'll go through that a little bit better there was a picture frame lots of paperwork um don't know really what oh, yeah, those are oh yeah wolverine jacket more paperwork that's one thing that we have found quite a bit of is paperwork vhs tape hopefully nothing weird we're not even gonna i'm not gonna mess with it at all okay. but like i said all the paperwork we will will return um we'll set this to the side so we can find a home for it more paperwork uh-oh hmm. jewelry box a big one. Oh, look at this and it is full you see put it right here almost there oh wow costume is it costume here, here. i'm just gonna show them real quick and then i'll let you kind of look through it but i know you guys probably the like the yeah yeah one of the hinges is broke but i know some of you guys love the costume jewelry so kind of go th we'll probably just go through it real briefly because it's a mess and then uh, a, yeah probably sell it all as just a bunch of unsorted uh, Mom, costume jewelry that's a pretty yes sir I found a little you did oh, that's an you got a bible that's that'll be something we save with the paperwork photo album Who's that little guy oh is it a planner no it's an album oh it's another photo album so that's pretty much it in here. It's pretty much all we got left in here is like mostly trash stuff. Um, there's still a box and another tote that we haven't gone through. And this is the very last one all the way at the, uh, at the very back. Yeah. Looks like pictures and stuff. Oh my God. Let me get this set down. We will. Ugh. All right, so my dad's trying to get out. I think that there's going to be a lot of personal pictures in here, so in paperwork, but maybe other stuff. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through this, and if there's anything exciting, I'll let you guys know. Here's something kind of interesting. Chevron paper pack. It's got a bunch of these different kind of, I imagine for scrapbooking, I guess. It's kind of interesting. So pretty much that entire tote is all just um, paperwork. The entire thing, all paperwork. It sucks because that's a big old tote. Hey, don't be tearing stuff up, bud. I want you to clean up all that paper that you tore off of it. Okay, clean it all up. Thank you. So I'm gonna get in here now with my trash can and start trying to uh, load some of the trash up. I don't know, I showed you guys a good picture of the, uh, or a good video clip of the bed, but stay tuned for the next um, next video. I'll show you guys that. Found this craftsman like a, uh, this craftsman um bench um there's a few other things but i mean you guys saw the majority of it there was nothing else super spectacular there is one more box that i forgot that we did not go to uh, go through it's back there somewhere um as far as trash goes we have one box and this thing here is full but we also have a lot of um 
documents and pictures that we have to return um you know these you whatever reason you get stuck in a bind you can't pay your bill on your storage unit it's understandable um this is just how the world works um your the storage facility sells the unit they, that's just what they do and it's put up for auction for people to come buy the the stuff if i hadn't bought it somebody else would have and they may not have been courteous enough to return the pictures and the documents and stuff i mean we found green cards and ids and just all kinds of stuff so we're gonna try to get most of it back to them baby pictures sonograms things like that so what we what we have to do with our particular unit is we have to make sure it's clear we leave it open make sure that um it's swept out real well actually i'm gonna leave i'm gonna go ahead and close ours but that was probably really loud but we're gonna get home i've got this sucker tied down real well we're gonna get home and uh not mess with it tonight because it's dark it's late and lauren just got off of work so she's tired i've been at this all day so i'm tired so but anyway anything you want to say what we got a lot i think we did pretty good we made our money back probably triple just off of this so i already showed you guys that a little earlier but anyway thanks for hanging out we'll see you guys next time like i said earlier look out for the next video of us kind of showing you guys most of the items see you next time uh -oh. say bye <laughs>